Hi, everybody. Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. When you have two great rushing attacks like these two teams have, we're going to spend a lot of time focusing and watching the great runs and the shifty moves of the running back. But the heart, the soul, the guts of both of these teams, the hog mollies, the fat guys, the smart guys, the offensive linemen who hold the key for both teams. That's going to do it for us. Thanks for checking out the pregame show. NCAA college football action coming right at you. Brad and Kirk on the call. David and I are back at halftime. And now let's head down to the coin toss and is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Palmers has got to forget about all the distractions, and that includes talking about winning awards. And in talking to him, he seems like a pretty focused, driven guy. Second down, five to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Here's the throw. I don't think he got anything on that. He didn't have much of a chance on that play. Boy, this defense has a lot of speed. They're all over him by the time he caught the ball. to that quickly right down at about the 49 this isn't even the best example but i'm going to tell you something this young man is really getting better at running his routes which is a truly underrated quality these days pulls it in and stops in his tracks with that tackle it to the left. That makes it third and seven. And once again they'll come to the line, try to convert on third down. It's a quick move to the tight end, but it's dropped. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. The quarterback in the gun. Empty backfield. Five wide receivers in the formation. He wants it all. What a pick. Tackle at the 49. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense. Defense. You gotta be careful to avoid these. Down. Penalties are a great way. First and ten. Ball on the 26. 
They come out on an empty backfield. Throws, and that one's going to hit the ground incomplete. I like the scheme the defensive coordinator came up with here. They were all over the place on that play and left the quarterback nowhere to throw it. We're at play number nine of this current drive. throws right away and he went way up and he's got the interception and down he goes at the 50 yard line you never like to have to play from behind but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds they just need to go out there and play they'll spread the field with five wide caught with room to work He's out to the 30. The 50. Inside the 30. He's tackled right around the 16-yard line. That's a game of 76 on the play. First down. Roger, Roger. Play 56, play 56. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Incomplete, trying to get it to his receiver. The defense needed that one. How about the move here by this quarterback? Great play that time, getting a hand on the football. From the 16-yard line, second down. And we welcome you back to the action here, and we have got a tight one going on in quarter number two. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Quick out to his receiver. Tackle made at about the 43-yard line. First and ten. Passes in and it's picked off by the safety. Got an opening. Touchdown. So a great play by the defender to give his team six points. That was a very good play, and that will certainly help Bill. It's going to be interesting now to see if this quarterback can put that last throw behind him. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off of mistakes. Gets it off as he's hit. Complete. And they make the stop around the 36-yard line. Not sure what the flag is about here. Let's go down to the field and find out. Offense. That penalty will move him back a bit. Yeah, with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. From their own 21-yard line, it's first down. Well defended, but it's complete for good yarding. It's a risky throw here by the quarterback. You cannot keep tossing it up into the secondary like that and expect your guy to come down with it every time. The defense is going to jump on one of those and take it the other way. Here we go! Strike complete, he's down. Nothing flashy at all, but now that first down marker is a lot closer. Ready. 
Throws complete. He's got room to work. And he's taken down around the 35-yard line. That was a really nice play on the ball by the receiver for a substantial gain and a first down. Quick throw, incomplete, one of his receiver. This quarterback needs to be careful not to use his arm strength to try to force things because that's when mistakes happen. It's second and ten. Ball on the 35. They come out in a five-wide set. He's rolling right. He gets sacked on the play. Man, these guys can be aggressive. When you stand back there and take hits like that, you definitely are going to feel it the next day. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. He lets it go. Completes. It's the junior. And he's tackled around the 12-yard line. And for Cooper, he's having one of this team's best passing seasons ever. It's been a terrific campaign for this young man from day one. Breaking that record would be quite an honor. From the 12-yard line, first down. Nice run up the middle. Palmer gets seven yards on the play. Second and three. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Again, he'll get the call. They'll bring him down to seven yard line. The D lineman wasn't letting anyone by him that time. And the big fella did a heck of a job plugging up the hole where that play was supposed to go. They're about four yards away here on third down. Taken down at the six-yard line. When you get in these third-down situations, a confident offense expects to get the yardage they need on the ground. It's a good job by the defense to shut that down. Quick pass brought down around the two-yard line. Unable to convert on fourth down, and the ball changes hands. So we're just about ready to return to action. Fires incomplete, knocked away. That is a great play here by the corner to be able to knock that football away. In many cases, you'll see a corner actually try to knock the football away and he'll interfere with the wide receiver. This time he keeps his body and arms away from the receiver and still knocks it away. That's a big time play. And he tackles him hard at the 22 yard line. From the 22 yard line, second down. Fires quickly, and they got it. Touchdown.
game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Scrambling around. Tackle at the 48-yard line. First down. Throws in a hurry. Incomplete. That's what the defensive back coach likes to see. His kids reacting when the ball is in the air and then making the play. Number six. Second down and ten to go. Ball in the 48. Backup quarterback into the game now to call the signals. He makes his way to about the 32. Good solid running right there. Getting past the defensive lineman and into the secondary before he could be stopped. quarterback got so excited to make this throw that I think he just put too much on the football. His receiver was open. He just misfired. Second and ten. Ball on the 32. Back to the tailback, but he can't bring it in. Delivers to the halfback on the screen. And down he goes at the 24 yard line. And that one's incomplete. Not sure about that play call as they fail on fourth down. Herbie went. Anyway, we still don't know the severity, but the bad news is he hasn't reappeared. Doesn't look like he's going to play any more football today. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. He lets it fly. Incomplete. That pass didn't look exactly right when it left his hand. Sometimes you don't get a great grip on the ball, and it comes out a little wobbly. From their own 34-yard line, it's second down. He sails it long. It's broken up. And he did a nice job breaking up that pass. But he did a great job here of not risking a big gain. Instead, he just batted it down. Empty backfield. Quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. And he hits him hard at the 23-yard line. Man, as an offensive lineman, this is the worst thing that you want to see. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. He airs it out. Complete. He's got room to the 10. He leaps, and he's in. Touchdown. He's got three TD catches now. Yeah, this guy's in his zone. He's catching every single ball thrown his way.
The offense will come out again, hoping to have similar results as their last drive. If you can bet this defense made some adjustments on the sideline, though. I don't know if they can stop the passing attack, but they need to at least be able to slow it down. Palmer picks up about four yards on the play. From their own 12-yard line, second down, Tulane with a one-point lead. Fires incomplete. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. to the senior. There's a very impressive open field tackle. Bauer on the tackle at the 31-yard line. That makes it first and 10. He flings it right. That makes it second and 10. From their own 31-yard line, it's second down. Play 56, play 56. Ready, ready, yes. ready, yes. He's tackled around the 45-yard line. Not the greatest pass, but a really, really good play by the receiver to bail out his quarterback. it into coverage and it's intercepted tackle made right around the 48 yard line he seemed a little hesitant on that throw and that left the defender time to break on the ball and pick it off The quarterback comes back on the field, and I'm sure he's hoping to make up for that interception on the last drive. One general rule in any game is to hold on to the ball. If you're in the negative in the turnover department, your chances of winning decrease exponentially. Intended that time for the wide receiver. Sometimes the ball just kind of sails on you. I'm sure he wouldn't mind having that one back. From their own 20-yard line, second down. Tulane is up one. Positive yardage. That's good to have been four yards. Third down. Third down. Quarterback couldn't maintain possession on their last drive. Let's see what he does here. The first rule on offense is to take care of the football. These guys need to remember that on this drive. Wants to throw outside. It's broken up. It's a great job here by the defensive coordinator with his play call. A lot of times you start to maybe think about blitzing linebackers. This time he keeps the linebackers back in position to be able to knock the football away and not give this offense a chance to pick up a first down. 
from their own 25-yard line. Second down. He makes his way to about the 38. Did you see how much space there was for that tailback up front? He better be thanking his offensive lineman for that. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it. yard line. So with one quarter remaining, Louisville leads it 28-21. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. He wants it all, and they intercept it. The junior safety. This is a pretty crucial series right here. With things being so tight, your best players have to step it up on both sides of the ball. And he's taken down around the 49-yard line. That'll make it second and inches. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. He's hit and taken down. The quarterback and his receiver make a great play here and convert on an early down. They'll spread the field with five wide. to his receiver. They'll bring him down at the 27. Gain of 11 yards. That makes it first and 10. Reset, right. Huge play, and it's going to be first and goal. That makes it first and goal. Well, this is it. They've got all four downs to get in the end zone. Quick strike to the receiver. Touchdown. So we're early in the fourth quarter. Still a lot of football left, but in a game this tight, every possession is going to make a difference. Looks left, intercepted. Just past the tackler. That's a great tackle at the five. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. it in as he's pushed out of bounds. I like the call here by the defense to bring the heat with the outside linebacker. It was just a better call by the offense and that's why it's a first down. Quick throw and he's got his receiver again. He's taken down at the 38-yard line. Number 
First down. Less than three minutes in the game. Terrific coverage, and when you clog up passing lanes like that, you can force a quarterback to make some poor decisions. Almost got themselves a turnover, too. It's second and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. Under heavy pressure. Throws off balance incomplete. Seven-yard line. Bauer races in down to the 27-yard line. line. That, that makes, makes it first, first and ten. Play 56, play 56. Ready? Let's it go. And it's going the other way. It's the senior corner. He steps up and makes a big turnover. Yeah, he just made a huge play right there. He knew what was coming. Second down, 13 yards to go. Ball on 24. First down, Graham. And that sets them up with a first and goal. That makes it first and goal. A little over a minute in the game. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Just a minute remains in this football game. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That makes his third and goal. their second time out of the half. So it's fourth and goal from the five, and the offense is still on the field trying to put this in for six. And it all comes down to this play right here. Two lanes call their final timeout. And that is an absolutely huge turnover for this defense. They couldn't have picked that off at a better time. Just a horrible decision by the quarterback trying to force that pass, especially at this point in the game. It's final, a close one to the very end. Louisville, 35, Tulane, 28. The Green Wave, 28. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.